What is going on, Get Your Fish On friends and family? Today, we are doing another unboxing. Monster Bass. This is the August Monster Bass subscription bag. So side note here, one of the things I really like about Monster Bass is that you get this bag. But we should be very clear, they're running out of stock of these things. So they're going to have to go back to those sucky boxes. This month's bag, that's right, I said bag because if you're new, we don't ship in a box because boxes suck. We ship in a reusable bait bag. If you don't know about Monster Bass, they are a monthly subscription. It's about $34, $35. They're supposed to send you seven to eight quality products and uh, they put it in a great bag that is always helpful for your fishing tackle stuff. Uh, Monster Bass has been on a roller coaster of good and bad months for a long time. In my opinion, I think this is probably the fourth or fifth best bag box, fishing tackle subscription box you can get each month. I think fishing. Florida Tackle Club is number one. I would go on record and say I think Bass Baits Monthly might be number two. I think the, the one from uh, Champions Club from Major League Fishing is probably number three. Mystery Tackle Box, Six Cents. Uh, all those are probably in that four or five. And then Monster Bass in recent months. Uh, I get a lot of... Uh, I know everyone doesn't like these Monster Bass bags. I, I know they don't. I, I see it in the the comments and I appreciate the comments and it really does have a somewhat of effect on how I'm going to move forward with Monster Bass. Today though we're going to do this like we normally do. We're going to look at this two ways. First the quality name products that are in there that are in here. There's supposed to be no overstock. There's supposed to be no uh, half sample packs. So we're going to look at it from on a 1 to 10 on that. Uh, and this is my opinion on it too. Then we'll look at it as an overall fish ability. I mean, did they send me something that I can't fish? That happens a lot. So we're going to look at it as, as critically as we can, yet it's an opinion at the same time. And what I want you to do is I want you to comment below on what you think the overall value is in terms of the name product. And then also from there on the fish ability of your area. This is the southern region box or the Florida box, I think, or Florida bag. So this should all be stuff used down here. So here we go. I haven't looked at this one at all. I haven't looked at it at all this month. No, they put it in good. I'm gonna put that in the trash. And there it is. Okay. Well, they're starting us off with a Larry Melton Jr. Tells you the price, all the stuff in there. There is usually a golden ticket. Here is the golden ticket. You can watch that every Thursday, Wednesday or Thursday on Monster Bass Live. And it looks like this month there is no sticker. And I love that. Oh, there is a sticker. There's a Monster Bass sticker and a free bait if you buy a striking Ocho Cinco. So if you want that, there it is. Okay, we're just going to start off with they sent us a tungsten. I don't even know what size it is. Three eighths, maybe. It says 3B. Oh, my light just went out in the back of me. Means my battery is dead. From there, they sent a pack of X Zone Adrenaline Bugs. That color is June Bug. And in Movie Magic, the light is now on. They sent us a. Pro Model Crankbait Strikes King Series 4. That's a 5 to 8 foot diver. That's a big bill for 5 to 8 foot. 
I'm going to say that's mislabeled again and it's a deeper bill than that. No good. They sent us a pack of Strike King Perfect Plastics. We pour technology. I'll open pour technology. This is the... It's a magic color. I don't even know. Not bad. It has five per pack. It's a five pack. Next from Arc is their TB111 Top Water Blower. I just did a, about eight months ago, I did a closer look on that, so you can go check that out if you want to. Nice little top water bait, great action, great action, ridiculous action. Next, they sent us a Lunker Hunt Thump. I'm gonna say no and no thank you. No, God! No, God, please, no, no! I mean, I know there's a lot of people like Lunker Hunt. I have to be just brutally honest. I don't see it anymore. Um, I just don't see the use of it. Uh, I don't think that there's a real good quality of this this product from Lunker Hunt, and it seems like everything is more gimmicky than anything. So, no offense to Lunker Hunt. I, I hate. I I don't even want to throw this. Next from Bait Labs, they sent a tournament win in action. One of the little crankbaits I guess it is the ricochet in evil crawl color you see that Let me get it there and then they sent some of their own oh they sent some spear point hooks and then they sent oh they sent some gap stoppers and look at this I got two spear point hooks in mine and you wonder why I didn't get hooks last month so they must have made up for it maybe I don't know so we got the the stoppers the hooks and the the weight for a terminal tackle that that in the bag then we got the soft plastics that were the KVD and the X zones, which are pretty decent. Those KVD are huge ones. We got the spinner bait, the KVD, the arc, and the bait laps as I drop them again. So, overall, in terms of name products, all of its name products this month, which is fantastic. Now there's some stuff that is their own stuff, which I can't really knock or say anything bad about. Uh, the tungsten, while it's just one, still is expensive to put in and probably be pretty good for them to do. The Lunker Hunt, I'm never ever, go ever gonna use. That KVD, I'm not sure I'm gonna use it, but overall, I know all the products in here and that's good news. So probably in terms of quality name products, I'm gonna give it only because the Lunker Hunt is in here, I'm going to give it a 9. Uh, if the Lunker Hunt wasn't in this bag, I'd give it a 9.5. That's the truth. The Lunker Hunt's actually taking the bag down. Uh, in terms of fishability, I'm not going to use the Lunker Hunt. I'm not going to use the the KVD, that, that square bill, that Series 4 that dives 5 to 8 foot. Those worms are humongous worms, so I don't know if I'll use those either, but still a decent product. The hooks I'm not going to use, and um, the other stuff is just minor. So in terms of fishability, I'm going to say I'd give this a seven and a half, eight. That's being really harsh and critical, but that's the truth. I do believe I'm their. I've said this. I do believe I'm their model person in getting these boxes because I fish from the shore, I pond hop, I do all that stuff. So everything that is in here, I want it to be able to be used in those situations. Because if you have a boat and stuff, good for you. But you're not, if you have a boat, you're probably not subscribing to this. I don't think you are. Uh, and if you are, even better for you. So tell me what you think. Comment below and tell me what you think. And uh, tell me what you think of the fishability and also what the overall, you know, the quality of the product is. 1 to 10 on both. There it is. Another month done, August. Monster Bass, South Edition, Southern Edition. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Thanks for watching. 
Thanks for being part of the team, and I hope that God is blessing you. Remember, take your kid fishing, get your fish on, kick in your bass, get your fish on. We will see you guys soon. Cheers. Hit like and subscribe. Take your own kids fishing. Pfft.